Hey guys, I hope you're having a great day today. So today I wanted to share with you um, a little Ulta haul. I I can't remember the last time I filmed an Ulta haul. Um, it's been a very, very long time. So I wanted to share um, with you guys some new things that I got. Um, maybe some of the things are not new to you, but they're new to me. So uh, let's go ahead and get started. Um, so the first thing that I um, picked up, and by the way, um, I purchased all of this with my own money. Um, I'm not being compensated. Um, I ordered everything off of their uh, of Ulta's website. So, um, okay. <laughs> so uh, the first thing that I got is this new CoverGirl primer. Um, it is the Outlast All Day Primer. Um, I am testing this out uh, today. Um, it, it just says um, all day primer keeps your makeup looking fresh. Um, there's no claims on it. Um, it's oil free. Uh, you get um, a fluid ounce. Um, so far, um, I feel like, I mean, it, it's it dries really quick I will say that um, it's a white uh, it's a white primer um, so uh, I'm actually going to be comparing it to my um, Laura Geller uh, spackle supercharged primer once I um, use this more um, again this is my first day using it so um, I'll need to test it out more but um, I am going to put it up against that and see um, how it does. So, um, I got this, so excited about that. Um, the next thing I got is a couple of lip products. Um, these are new from L'Oreal. Um, I got two different uh, ones, so there's two different lines. There's Le Matte and Lilac. Um, so this is the Le Matte one. Um, it is in number 108, matter of fact. Um, it's, and you know, again, you can't really judge the color on the Ulta website, so it actually is a little bit brighter um, than I was uh, expecting, but it's, it's nice because it's one of those retractable um, lip products, which I'm all for, um, so, uh, there's the color it's uh, again it's matter of fact it's uh, it's a little bit it's I'd say it's like a little deeper um, it's fuchsia but it's uh, it's a little darker um, if that makes any sense uh, it's it's a deep fuchsia color. There we go. <laughs> um, and then the next one is from the Lilac line. Uh, so, um, as you probably could tell, this one, so matter of fact, is um, completely matte. Um, the Lilac one has a little bit of shine, and it is in number 201. Um, <laughs> I love these names, so especially in the, the the lac line. So it's number two hundred one, uh, Lackey Charm, um, and again, it's the whole twist up uh, pencil. So um, I really like this one. I wanted to get a brighter color and a neutral, and that's what this one is. So um, that is. Uh, the Lilac one that is um, Lackey Charm. So the top is Lackey Charm, the bottom is Matter of Fact. So um, I think it's it's a like mauve ish shade. Um, I I like it. Um, I haven't um, I haven't worn them yet, but uh, I like the colors. So okay. Oh, moving on. I'm sorry if it seems like I'm scatterbrained today, you guys. I just haven't filmed a video in so long. It seems kind of weird. Um, okay, the next um, lip product I got is uh, one of the NYX High Voltage lipsticks. And I got um, a little bit of a um, 
neutral shade just because I didn't want one that was extremely potent just because I know that these are these pack a punch um so this one is in flutter kiss um it's kind of like a brownish it's like a brownish mauve I guess um there it is right there um I applied it this morning and then I changed my mind on what lip color I was wanting to wear but um I really really like this shade I'm so sorry if you guys hear my dogs barking. Um, it's uh, it has a little bit of sheen um, to it, but it's not uh, doesn't have sparkle or um, shimmer. It just has a little bit of shine to it. Um, so I'm happy with those purchases. Um, okay, so I bought um, a couple of blushes. So the first one I bought is uh, from NYX, and it is one of their um, they're HD blushes and it is in the color Intuition. Um, I heard Emily talk about this in one of her videos, um, and I absolutely love it. Um, here, I'll, I'll swatch it for you. Uh, it is the most gorgeous shade. Um, I don't know if you'll be able to see that. Uh, it reminds me um, a little bit of, so there it is right there. Um, it reminds me a little bit of, um, the, uh, oh, what shade? Um, Blushing Rose from e.l.f. Um, it's got that same sheen. Uh, it has, this has a little bit of, um, uh, sparkle to it. Um, it's got like gold flecks in it, which I think is really, really pretty um, for fall. Um, and maybe maybe for summer, I don't know. We'll see. Um, but I, I really, really like the color, so I'm happy with that. Um, and then the next blush I got is uh, from Urban Decay, and it is the Afterglow blush in Crush. First of all, this packaging is amazing. Um, I really like the little um, emblem they used. I really, really like it. So Urban Decay always does amazing with their packaging. Um, so you open it up, and once again, look at the packaging. Um, and this is the color. Again, the color is Crush. Um, it is completely matte. I didn't want um, a super... Uh, sparkly shade um, with this line because I know I knew that these packed a little bit of a punch because they're highly pigmented um, but so there is a swatch of crush and it's next to the the NYX blush and in intuition um, so it's a little bit of a brighter pink um, but I think it's absolutely perfect for um, summertime so it's one of the reasons why I picked that color um, yeah, I, I'm really impressed with it. So I'm excited to play with it. Um, the next product, ooh, as I drop everything and knock everything over, um, is, uh, a, another NYX product and it is one of their, um, prismatic eyeshadows and this is in the color Punk Heart. Um, I ordered a couple of these, but one of them came shattered so <laughs> I need to uh, return it uh, and exchange it but um, this is the color punk heart um, I love this color it is so freaking pretty um, so there it is right there I love it it's amazing you guys so again I'm so sorry they're barking at my neighbors. Um, so this is Punk Heart. It's a deep, it's a, I don't know that I would say, it's, yeah, I guess I would say like eggplant. So it's like a deep, deep eggplant. Um, it does have a little bit of shimmer to it. Um, well, maybe not shimmer. It's more like sheen, um, which I think is really pretty. So 
um, I I really really like it so I am uh, I'm excited to play with it so um, so that's it for uh, eyeshadows and such um, the last product that I ordered is um, and I haven't heard many people talk about it, is the Lorac Pro Contour Palette. Um, now this comes with a brush. Uh, there's the brush. Um, I haven't washed this yet, uh, but I am so far loving how soft it is. Um, it kind of has a blunt cut, but it's um, tapered here. Uh, it's got like this rounded kind of curve, which will be interesting um, for contouring. Um, I think it would work fine, but we'll see. So, um, so far I'm really liking how, um, how soft it is, um, but I need to wash it to see if it sheds at all. So, um, and then you have the uh, contour palette. Um, you have a nice big mirror with it, um, and then let me remove this plastic. And then you have all these different um, contour, shade, contour shades. So, um, and you have, so you have three highlights and three um, contour shades. So, um, you have a shimmer highlight up here, and then in the middle you have a yellow highlight and then on the end you have a uh, beige highlight and then down here you have the light highlight I'm sorry light um, contour the medium contour and then the uh, deep I think okay I switched those so you have the light the deep and the medium contour um, I am really excited to play with this um i i wanted to get my hands on it so um i'm really excited to play with it so uh be sure to um subscribe to my channel because i will be uh i will be reviewing this soon plus i may throw it in a few tutorials so um i'm really really excited to play with it um all right, well, uh, that actually concludes my um, Ulta haul. It was a little small, but I still wanted to share it with you guys. So, um, yeah, so that is it. Um, I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you so, so much for watching, and I'll talk to you very soon. Bye.